First up, we're in the US, where nothing in motorsport comes close to the nitro-burning top fuel dragsters roaring down the quarter mile at breakneck speed. And right now, one team from the Middle East are shaking up the NHRA series in the US. Qatari-owned Alan Abbey Racing. And following their first NHRA season in 2009, the team were looking for even better results this year. Obviously, we, were, we wanted to win the championship, but realistically there was a lot of stuff that we had to develop and, and learn as a team and I think we've we did a good job of that. With former two-time NHRA champion Larry Dixon at the wheel their improvement in 2010 has happened about as fast as their quarter mile sprints with an amazing 12 wins in 12 final rounds and it takes cars with some very impressive performance stats to achieve that kind of result. Around 8,000 horsepower is produced by the custom-built 500 cubic inch V8 engines. Drop the clutch and 160 kilometers an hour arrives in just under a second. In three seconds, you're at 440 kilometers an hour and pulling 4.7 G. In under five seconds, you've crossed the line and burned 45 liters of nitromethane fuel. At just 23 years of age, the Royal Sheikh is determined to put Qatar and drag racing on motorsport's global map. And not just by promoting it on the wings of a top fuel dragster. I think the better we do, the more he is, he is out there to show us off, you know, to the people of Qatar, the people of the Middle East, and the, the people out there. So uh, I think he gets a lot of satisfaction out of it. So with a very successful second US season just about wrapped up for Alan Abbey Racing, and Sheikh Khalid Al Thani. This is one drag racing team from the GCC that manager Alan Johnson is sure will light up the drag strip for a long time to come. It all comes down to one thing. It's, it's drag racing. He loves it, I love it. And uh, together we're gonna win a lot of races.